In this tutorial, you will learn about the keyword research tool that I use, especially when I'm doing SEO campaign or Google Ads campaign. And the best thing is these tools are for free. Hey everyone, Carlos Obado here and I'm a digital marketing expert who specializes in lead generation and I also teach about Facebook ads, Google ads, and SEO. And so, if that's something that you are into, then consider subscribing. So this is the number one tool that I recommend. It's from Google. It's called the Google Keyword Planner. All you have to do is sign up. Sign up to a Google ad account and you should be able to have access to this. So after signing up to a Google ad account, just click tools right here. And you should be able to see keyword planner right here. Just click on that. And then you will be redirected here. So let's go ahead and try it out. Let's say sunglasses for men and let's get the result now if you are not running the ads the only downside is Google Keyword Planner will give you just a range of the search volume so in this case it's saying that for this term the search volume every month is between 1,000 to 10,000 so that's the only downside. Now you can easily do that by running an ad. Just put the budget on, on the lowest budget that you can, you can have, you can set for your campaign. That might be, if you're in the Philippines, let's say, that can be like 20 or 30 pesos. Just put a dollar or two perhaps. So you can see the actual search volume right here. So let's go to one of the accounts where I am running ads. I'm running ads from. So let's go ahead and type the same country. Let's hit save and let's type the same term and get the result. And as you can see here, it's showing the exact search volume, which is 2,900 which is also within the range within the range of this one so 2900 is between 1000 to 10000 now the second free keyword tool that i recommend is keyword surfer so you can go ahead and add that as an extension for your Google Chrome browser and then what happens is when you do a Google search let's search for the same term it will show you this tab right here where you can see the search volume this is for for United States I believe as you can see the flag so this term right here sand glass it's around 300,000 sunglasses for men it's 90,000 and now the downside of this is you cannot go per state or per city and also the countries here are limited and like if you are using Google Keyword Planner you can be more granular when it comes to location because you can target per city for example, if I want to target just Metro Manila, I can do that here. Save the search and it will give you the search volume. If you are using this, it's only best use if you are trying to get the search volume within a countrywide basis. If you find this video helpful, please smash that like button. And if you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to comment them below and I will reply to each and every one of them.